Hello and welcome back to Fallout 76. I am Wiggle and this is the RNG playthrough. If you have any questions about the rules of the playthrough, they are in the description below. Also in the description is a link to my Discord server. And as always, if you enjoy my content, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, in the last part, we did a bunch of pulls from the purveyor, uh, all armor pieces and all trash. So we are our armor hasn't changed in a while. Uh, we also opened a perk card pack, uh, same story, all trash. So yeah, that's uh, that's kind of how it's been going. Uh, and we continued on the uh, Commander de Guerre uh, quest line. Uh, I think we're probably close to the halfway point. I'm not sure exactly. I forgot to, to check it. Uh, but before we do that, I, I remembered that, uh, yeah, since the pit update, uh, f uh, max level chainsaws, uh, rippers, and drills are a thing. And also they can now drop as legendaries. And so I thought... What I would like to get, instead of using the shredder that I've been using, it does okay, uh, but it's not great, honestly. Uh, I know where I can get a chainsaw that's not legendary, and I can buy the, the mods, or at least some of the mods, uh, from a, a train station and apply them. Uh, but what I thought I would do first, I have a little over 400 scrip, and I thought I would do some legendary melee weapons, maybe get a chance to get one of those... You know, a good chainsaw or a, a ripper or a drill just for some, you know, to mix things up. Uh, and I'm going to go for two stars since I don't have a ton of script. So if I go for two stars, they're 50 script and I can get eight of them. Uh, and maybe I'll get lucky with one of those. And if not, then I will go find a non-legendary chainsaw in the world. And uh, I think I want to try using that for a bit. So without any further ado, let's uh, go over here to... This is Purveyor, and uh, see what she's got for us. So we want melee weapons, legendary. All right, here we go. Nope, faster swing speed I'm okay with. Uh, nothing else, I'm not okay with that. And a spear. Okay, so we're just going to be cursed. No matter what we do, anti-armor, yep, yeah, blocking. <laughs> so, another spear. Okay, yeah, it doesn't matter what I do. There's just no... <laughs> there's just... I mean, these aren't even good. Uh, buzz blade, yeah. Of all the spinny weapons, that's the one I get. And limb damage. So two more here. Uh, yeah, faster swing speed, but no. Uh, nocturnal, oh, and swing speed. So I got swing speed on three of them and they're all just, uh, I mean, that's pretty good damage, but uh, yeah, we just don't have enough for, you know, for things that swing that slowly, we just can't make that work. Okay, okay. So that was an idea that I had. It turned out not to work so well. So we are going to go grab a chainsaw in the world. All right, here we are at the Metal Dome. Oh, the and if you just run on through to the other side, there should be a chainsaw waiting for us. I'm on a private world, so this should be here. Which is one of the reasons I'm on a private world. There's our chainsaw. And just to make sure it's level 50, it needs some repairs, but that's okay. Now I will go to the train station and buy some mods. Alright, here we are at RNG, and I just had to dispatch a ghoul officer. To the door mod. So if we go to the mods, we want the Chainsaw Flamer mod and the Chainsaw Bobar mod. Now we just need uh, to apply them. All right, well, here we are with our modded chain uh, chainsaw. Uh, we're using the uh, the long the longbow bar and the flaming mod. Yeah, the flaming mod. Uh, yeah, I would uh, I would go for the dual bar, but that requires. I mean, I can scrap chainsaws to learn it, but it requires makeshift warrior four, which I do not have. So yeah, we'll have to give this a go, and I think it'll work out better than the uh, the shredder. And uh, yeah, first stop is Braxton's Medical Supplies. And let's go there and get whatever it is. I think it's medical records we have to get. So let's uh, do that. Uh, of course, using this means we've given up on stealth completely. But uh, it's not like that's Would been working out so well. Are you I'm kidding me? me. Oh, all right, that works out. Okay. Usually this is a war zone up here. So who knows what will you can find anything and everything up here. And we have, oh, Cultus. Oh, that worked out. Cultus, hang on. Oh, nope, not Brotherhood. 
Wait, what am I missing? Oh. Okay, this works out way better than the shredder. Plus I can use it in first person or third person, no problem. There we go. <laughs> Alright, I'm liking this already. I'm gonna join up. Feels like an actual upgrade. Plus I can swap back and forth and I don't have to worry about ammo, it'll just swap back and forth. Nice. Alright. Let's see. The commander wants us to get this. Medical records. Uh, okay, bring okay, bring the medical records back to Daguerre. Okay, that's what we will do. Alrighty, and Mr. Creepy Guy is back. Not still chasing ghosts. <laughs> Emerson, what did you know about Dr. Bernard's deep sleeper pods? <sighs> I knew some of it. I was just a manager. I didn't really read the technical mumbo jumbo. Hey, friend. You're back. Just in time for the three of us to discuss what we found. Tell me you're not still chasing ghosts. <laughs> Emerson. Hmm. What did you know it's repeating about parts of the Bernard's conversation. Deep sleeper pods. <sighs> I knew some of it. We already heard that part. Here's your medical records. Transfer them to my console, please. What were they doing? Emerson. Tell me. It was a biomedical thing with Arctos. I don't know the details anymore. It was literally decades ago. You get that, right? It wasn't decades ago to me. Time to spill your guts, old man, one way or another. All right, all right. Jeez. I'd like to chainsaw him. Our that would be fun. Farm and the USSA made a deal to use some serum in the Deep Sleep Project. They made it, but it didn't work. Okay? Okay. That's enough for now. <sighs> Emerson, could you please leave? Maybe try to remember something helpful for next time. Bring her something for these headaches next time. Right, fine, I will. I, I should. I meant to. I just got distracted. Right. Privacy violation. <laughs> Look at what I got. <laughs> I got a ripper. That's funny. Uh, how's that compared to the chainsaw? That's 35 damage, really? But that's that's burning damage. But I could get the... Uh... Yeah, I might have to try that as well. That's funny. <laughs> okay, what's we next here? We just have to move forward here. <laughs> that's what the Mistress of Mystery would do when she was betrayed. Uh, this stuff okay. caused my headaches, then maybe they made an antidote? It's... it's a start anyway. Just send me a location. I'll find the contract. While I was looking for the deep sleeper pod documents a while ago, I found another location that might have stuff like old USSA contracts. Alright, I'll be back later. Roger. Stay safe out there. Okay, so she wants us to go where? Uh, here? What? So it added a knife edge map location, but we have to go into the Capitol building. All right, that'll work. Uh, yeah, we'll go there. Uh, I will stop and get a mod because I know I can get a box mod. I, th I think for the extended barrel on the uh, or the extended blade on the Ripper. So uh, yeah, I can use both of those. Cool. All right, so here we are with our Ripper and our Chainsaw. So, yeah, let's see how this goes. I know with the Ripper you can sneak a little bit. I mean, it's not a stealth blade, but it is... Uh, it's definitely quieter than uh, the Chainsaw. Of course, when you're found...
There we go. That works. Now, what would be ideal is if, when we were at the uh, purveyor, if we picked, had picked up a... Uh, like a vampire version of one of these. So I've been Oh, I have been in here before, right? I've gotten I've gotten Oh no, I haven't gotten this, but I know I've been in this building before. Oh, but just not this part. Okay, Overseer's Log. Overseer's Log, Charleston Capital. If automation still rules West Virginia, then Charleston is the heart of the machine. Bureaucracy still pumping away without any people to serve. There's a lesson there. Dealing with these terminal systems like it's just a normal day in America. Somewhere between comforting and completely insane. But we'll need to find. Alright, so the Ripper just doesn't seem to cut it. Is what it's looking like, not as a, not in a non-legendary form without any perks. And even though the chainsaw is noisier, it still seems to uh, be better because I can actually kill stuff, take less damage. Oh, something's back there. All right, so we have to go... Where are we going? Upstairs. Yeah, this kills things much faster. There's a light right here. Oh, the down... Whoa, 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 whoa. Ah! I didn't notice my health. Darn it. <laughs> okay, where do I respawn? Uh, okay, in the starting area. I did not notice my health. Bad on me. Yeah. Some better armor would be nice. But I don't think that's going to happen. I think our armor and our weapons are pretty much kind of where they're at here. Okay, so we do have... does need a bit of AP, so I do have to watch that. Since we've only got... Uh, I think we have one piece of armor. What do we got here? Zealot's 10 mil. That's not any good. Replenish action points. Damage to Scorch. Still not any good. Since I can't really mod it. Wait, are there stairs? I don't know where the stairs are. Are they this way? Oh, there's a loot bag. Oh, that's my stuff. Cool. Oh, here we go. Up this way. It's been a while. Okay. Oh. Oh, this is fun. <laughs> oh, health, 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 health. The problem is, it's like the spinny things you have to. Ah! <laughs> I have to wait for the thing to spin down before I can stim. Oh, that's frustrating. <laughs> okay, well, this is okay, but our AP just. We don't have a lot. Uh, yeah, what's our AP at? Yeah, 200 just isn't a whole lot. So having something that... Uh, yeah, I don't really know what the solution would be with that. I guess if I was using power armor, I well, I don't, I probably couldn't apply any mods anyway. Because I know there's that, that mod that uses fewer action points for power attacks. Uh, on power armor. But uh, yeah, I probably couldn't apply it anyway. All right, so maybe this isn't, I don't know. <laughs> I keep looking for solutions and all the everything just comes back with you suck. <laughs> Your build sucks. Your weapons suck. All right. Uh yeah. 
Yeah, we definitely want to be at full health because of our stupid Vanguard pieces. Let's see, where are, there's more stairs somewhere. I don't know if they're on this side or not. I don't remember. Well, that's not. Oh, that is it. Okay. Uh. I mean, I like this weapon. It'd be nice if we could uh, not have to be so up close and personal. And if I had a Ripper that actually had good stats, that would actually be better, because that is a bit stealthy, but... Or, you know, in, in comparison to this. So let's uh, get rid of some Rads. And maybe do a Rad X, so they can't quite hit us so hard. And maybe do Psycho Tats. Sure, why not? We'll just do all the drugs. Now that I've probably gone through all the ghouls, there's probably no more left. Or there's this one. Well, I'm getting some caps here and there. Uh, let's see. Government contract. Yeah, I'm not going to read that. I'll let her do that. And, all right, now it's back to Daguerre. I probably could have gone in through the roof or something, made this a little easier. So, yeah, back to Daguerre. Yeah, our biggest our biggest problem with just melee attackers in general is we have no blocker. And usually I would do that on pretty much any build. So, uh, yeah, that, that's, that, I mean, that makes such a huge difference. With that, with not really strong armor and no blocker, uh, we just get ripped to shreds. Wendigo, ghouls, yeah. Anyway. It's always good to see figures he wasn't just a manager he made the offer himself damn man maybe i can find out more about this serum though in the meantime let's just eliminate that rogue ussa robot that's lurking around monitoring us it gives me the creeps uh, I'll take care of this robot. Uh, maybe a problem. Back in I don't my know. We'll see. Days, we used to watch robots fight in the basement of the science building. We used to joke about how scary that would be. You know, if they ever came after us all, that kind of thing. Uh, yeah. Anyway, thanks. Uh, I'll be back later. Roger. Stay safe out there. All right. What are we going to get this time? Probably nothing good. We need legendary stuff uh, at this point, like good legendary stuff. And a power fist plan just isn't gonna cut it. All right, so we need to go to boot camp. Uh, oh wow, and there's a mole rat horde event going on right there. New up train, okay, and there's robots. Um, okay, that is our next stop. Spawners reborn, well we're not doing that. Just because I'm near the, the white spring. Okay, so yeah, this is. I was thinking, what I was thinking when she saw that was this. So yeah, this is ghouls. More ghouls. More ghouls. They're squishy, but they hit hard. Can I jump up here? I cannot. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Let's see here. Let my AP come back. Alright. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Every solution I think of, I just run into roadblocks because of our uh, crappy perks. We could just choose something or get some good luck. Oh, look at that. Power armor. Uh, no. If it was a full set, I'd be tempted to go in and try it out. In fact, I should do that. Okay, there's a robot up here somewhere. 
thing is, I have Troubleshooter's armor, but I don't really want to put it on because then I'd really get squished by the ghouls. Uh, robot is... What's the area that we're in? Okay, so it's just somewhere around here. I don't even know what kind of robot I'm looking for. Oh, is it that? Oh, it's that? Okay. Alright, I'm in trouble. I'm just gonna pre-stim here. My AP's gone. Did I kill it? No, I did kill it. Okay, algorithm update. I'll take a stim pack. We seem to be using them more lately. I can get away from here without... Ah, okay. Uh, there's a ghoul there. And a ghoul there. <laughs> I mean, it kills things pretty quickly, but... Yeah. All right. Uh, we're in caution, but I don't see anything. Back. Yep. You know, back to the commander to Gare. Oh, what's this? Is this a thing? Oh, I actually have a. Oh, maybe there's something good in here. I mean, yeah. Actually, that's not bad. All right. Uh, yeah. Back to camp. Commander de Gare. Here you are. I was just same as the other USSA robots. Right before you arrived. It sent out two signal bursts. One to a robo-brain, and another to... something else. Are you with me on this, my friend? Can I count on you? Sure. Please, call me Sophia. And thank you. It means so much after... after everything else has been changed. You've been here for me the whole time. I couldn't have done any of this without you, you know. And that means a lot to me. Locating that medical cache that has that serum wasn't actually as hard as I thought it might be. Hopefully it'll be a milk run <laughs> to pick up, Because you didn't too. do anything. I suddenly realized that the expression milk run might not have much of a meaning in this apocalyptic world. Yeah, since everything is dangerous now. Huh. I'll find this serum. Won't take long. It's probably decades old and unusable by now, but it might tell us something. I'm not a chemist, though. Maybe... I don't know. I'll be back later. Affirmative. Out. I like how she talks about how easy it was because she didn't actually go anywhere. Of course it was easy. I died twice. Okay, right away. Assault rifle. Fusion. Okay, nothing I care about. Uh, let's see. Past expiration. Where is that? Oh, oh, fan inside a Robco. Oh, that's is it inside or is it behind Robco? Maybe it's behind because there are Robo brains down there behind, and it's moving around. Ah, eh, maybe it is. That'd be much easier. Okay, Robco next stop. Okay, well we're at Robco and that marker is coming from outside, which is good. I'm going to equip my anti-robot armor. Hopefully, not need it. Uh, I don't plan to do anything too nutty. Uh, he's not coming. I am not sneaky. Uh-oh. I don't think the light from the chainsaw does anything. Like, I just think I'm just not stealthy. And I could always switch to the fix. Oh, that's not a fixer. All right, let's try this. There we go. All right. Yeah, the robot armor seems to help, or the anti-robot armor, rather. Troubleshooters. I didn't take a whole lot of damage there. 
which I am okay with. Yeah, it'd be kind of funny if robots turned out to be like the least dangerous enemies. If I could just get a chess piece that was troubleshooter, just like a full set. Let's see here. I shouldn't have... Problem is... <laughs> my AP just doesn't... Still one left, right? Yes. This one should be close to dead, though. All right. So what are we... Oh, it's right here. Serum Z, of course. It's been sitting in this cooler all along. And what do you know? We go back to Commander Daguerre. Well, here's something I just looked at, and I'm glad I did. So I repaired this chainsaw up to 100% before I started using it. And it's already almost broken. And that's with two ranks of makeshift warrior. So... In theory, that's 20% slower. Uh, wow. So I gotta make sure I repair that before we head out again. Hey, you. Hey there. Look who decided to grace us with his presence. I brought another emergence kit. It's well past its expiration, but, well, everything is. It should be fine. Thanks, Emerson. I appreciate it. I do. We have some questions for you, though. We know you made the deal with Arctos Pharma. Why? It was my job. I was told to do that. I, I don't remember the reasons why anymore. And what does it matter anyway? It's done. It's over. Enough, Emerson. Why should we trust you with anything you say? I'm a different man now. It's been decades. I've been eating out of trash cans. I barely remember anything from back then. I have been trying to help when and where I can. I promise I have. I've diverted the robots when possible. I just couldn't destroy them myself. I came to Appalachia because I knew this ship was running out of fuel and I knew its autopilot would steer it here. Why can't you just tell me everything that happened? Because I have to finish my job, too. I had one more task to do here in Appalachia, and I'm close. Let me clean up my own messes. I have to go. I'll drop off some more emergence kits soon. Just please stop looking into this. There's a robo-brain on your trail. Focus on that. All right, focus on the robo brain. So the serum is real. How? How could they do this? Why didn't they just ask? I probably would have agreed. Damn it! Part of me wonders if Emerson what is her told head us doing? about this robo brain, so he would have more time to do whatever he's up to. <laughs> It was rather easy to pinpoint it once I realized I had to recompute the signals for things that had some organic parts. Got it. Go kill the robot. Again. I'll be right here then. Don't worry. You don't miss that much while you're out. Traders stop by from time to time. A couple other random people, but it's pretty quiet. I'll be back later. Affirmative. Out. Alright. Anything good? Probably not. But let's see, just in case. And the sun's coming out. That's good. Stim packs, recipe. All right, nothing I care about. Um, we are going... Let's see, I need to repair that. No brainer. Okay, so that's over near Camp Venture. All right, that's where we're going. Okay, so we are near... Ooh, I wonder if it's where the cultists are. That could present a challenge. But what doesn't present a challenge, really? I 
I mean, it kind of it kind of seems like maybe that might be what's going on. I may end up having to deal with cultists as well as a robot. Okay, something's seeing me here. Oh, it's down there. I'm just in caution. Maybe I'll stay in caution. I had visions of getting a chainsaw and just carving a path of destruction, but not so much. We're a bit on the low AP side and the squishy side for that to happen. Yeah, it looks like cultists and robots are uh, like a good combo here. Maybe drugs. Maybe I need to do some drugs. Let's see. What are What's a good drug I could do? Psychotats. Psychotats. That'll work. Maybe. Okay, now I'm in the area. I mean, what <clears throat> what are the chances that the robot isn't inside there? Really? I don't even know how to get in. Well, there's Moth Home. His uh, I think I heard the, uh, the I heard treads. Where the hell, how the hell do I get in here? Oh, there's a guy up there. Okay, in this way. All right. Maybe. Oh, there it is. And I'm out of, yeah, out of AP. <laughs> Keep trying to reload. Quit throwing grenades at me. I agree I should never have, but uh, I killed it. I'm waiting for the updated. Uh, okay, return to Commander to Gear, which seems like a good idea. Run away, run away. They don't seem to let me want to run away. Okay, now I'm in caution. All right, maybe they're going to let me run away. There's one over there, but I think... Oh, now I'm hidden. Okay. Back to Commander Daguerre. Alrighty. Whoops. A little, little hiccup there. Uh, hey. When you killed that robo-brain, the scanner seemed to pick up on some high-security signals all around yeah. the area. Maybe well, it was somehow area, interfering with our scanner? Like That's my best guess. A lot of these are high-security signals. Things related to the Deep Sleep Projects. Other projects, too. Ones I don't know much about. From the signature of the signal here, it seems to be a classified meeting between top officials regarding the Deep Sleep Project. Can you stop by and pick it up? I figure it might give us some more leads, or a name, or anything. Get the top secret meeting notes. You got it. Yes, I suspect it's a holotape, but it isn't an unusual place. As if it was moved here to hide it, maybe. I'll be back later. Affirmative. Out. Okay, so I got a level up, but it's not an important one. Although none of them really are. So we need to go to... I don't care about the rewards. They're not good. Uh, ugh. Okay, Snallygasters, my old friends. Okay, I mean, probably. A flooded train yard. I have not been there before, so that will take a, that'll be a little bit of a trek. Uh, but yeah, that's where we're going next. Okay, so starting from Watoga Station, we head this away. And it's funny, like sometimes glowing plague grad rat. Okay, because sometimes you can encounter, like I've encountered Mirelurk queens. Sometimes there's nothing between here and there. I'm hoping a rad rat is something we can deal with. And now I have bone worms, so there's that. I think bone worms is yeah more limb damage. Let's see. I you know I have plenty of disease cures. Okay, but our food situation. 
All right. It's like I hate having to be so cautious all the time, but uh, yeah, we just go down so easily. There is nothing in here except a safe I cannot open. Yeah, I mean, usually there's five, six Snallygasters in this place. So, and I'm guessing this will be all the way at the end. That chainsaw is kind of loud. I know. I want to... Let's do this. Give us a little bit of stealth. Maybe we can sneak through this. That would be something. Something welcome. It would also be a surprise. It's a lot of radiation here, but not too much. But I'll take a rad X just in case. Yep, there's a Snallygaster. And so much for stealth. <laughs> but, uh... Oh. We're just so weak, and enemies are... Every time we level up, enemies get stronger. And we are not. We are done getting stronger. Although, you know, there's lots of perks we could get, but... Uh, that is not something I want to hang my hat on. That was a waste of a crit. He was almost dead. Oh, well. So I got one more over that way. And I think I can maneuver my way up here onto this. Oh, and he's legendary. Cool. Give me, like, uh, something good. He got us once with one blob of poison, but uh, that went okay. Anti-armor short combat rifle. Well, that could be good. It probably uh, bats crits do 50% more. One agility. Um, yeah, it's probably not quite enough to give up the fixer. Honestly, probably not. Okay, so we. Oh, where are we going? Oh, we're not going where I expected. Darn it. <laughs> I was. I was hoping we were, uh, we got past the la- We have to go to the other side? I guess we have to go to the other side. One more Snelly? No, maybe? Yes? Unless he's in here, which I guess could happen. Especially to this character. Doctors, hello from Earth. The full board is here, waiting for your reports. Dr. Carroll, can you begin? Phase two analysis. Subject Degwetter is responding well. The sleeping pod is performing within all expected parameters. Thank you, Doctor. Uh, yes, the board has a question for you. How long can the subject remain in your device? I wouldn't expect much degradation to occur for at least a few decades. Hard to estimate beyond that. Over. Is Dr. Nowak on the line? Oh, um, yes, that's me. I'm, I'm here. And by here, I mean it, in orbit in space, looking down at the Earth where you all are. We got it, Doctor. Thanks. We have a question for you. Can you determine whether the connection has been made? Yes. I can determine that the connection has been made. The Athena unit has full access. Confirmed. Pathways are open. Connection is complete. Thank you. We have a question for Dr. Lee. I'm here. 
Sorry. Just had to fix a transmitter refraction. Enough. Dr. Lee, how stable is the ship at its current position in orbit? Uh, fine? It's fine. It should probably last, uh, as long as she does, anyway. Probably. I, I mean, definitely. Perfect. Oh, is the ship's USSA VOT currently available and nearby? Affirmative. Pandora unit is ready for orders. Excellent. Pandora, escort the doctors to their own personal deep sleep pods. You need to say the code, Rob. Your team made it. You should know that. <laughs> Red sunrise? Expulsion will begin in 30 seconds. Enter your assigned pod immediately. Wait, what? This isn't part of the experiment methodology. Well, also, we don't agree, right, doctors? You can't do this! To get a sleep pod is inside the main escape capsule. We need to get it out so we can get out of here. Come on, someone help me open this thing! The board is in violation of our contract! I, I want the USSA on the line right now! The USSA is well aware of the current status, Dr. Carroll. Thank you. Please cooperate now. Expulsion will begin in 30 seconds. Enter your assigned pod immediately. Blade electrified. 10 seconds. Get in! Get in quick! Phase 3 is now officially underway. Now, we just have to wait and see how Athena responds with three sources. Congratulations, everybody. All right, well, it appears that Emerson is kind of, uh, yeah, kind of not a nice guy. All right, we are going to, let's see, yep, back to the Commander Daguerre. All righty, okay, there she is. Of course, this hey is where you. she is. This is where she always is. By to Brighton. Did you listen to this already? But one thing at a time. The key seems to be Athena. Wait, one of the signatures I've been tracking. Arachne. Oh, that can't be a coincidence. There's a signal coming from some sort of object. Something called Arachne. It's got to be related. So I'm looking for Arachne. All right. It's got to be connected to Athena. Both are from Greek mythology. Arachne was a weaver and a brilliant one. She challenged the goddess Athena somehow and, well, she was turned into a spider. You know... Like arachnids, right? Some versions of the story say she won. Others say Athena won. I don't remember the details. And does it matter? I don't know that either. I know it's a stretch. But it's the only connection I can think of. I'll be back later. Affirmative. Out. <laughs> And a little bit of a frog in my throat. Jeez. Okay. And recipes and whatnot. So, who sat down beside her is... Okay. I'm not sure if that's in the caverns or near the caverns. I'm not sure. But we are not going to find out today. I think that is enough. I think we'll end things right here. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed this part. If you have, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, I hope you'll join me in the next one. Thank you very much.